Hello everyone, today it's time to put some audio into the UTV. So I got a couple of items that I want to install and I made a couple of custom brackets for them. And I want to bring you along for the process. So, um, look at some of the items that we got for this build. And one is a um, mirror with a built-in like uh, MP3 player and stuff, and then a leapy amplifier get the sound out. And I had some old speakers that I'm just gonna try in the, in the UTV. They're not good, so replace those later and got this uh, 48 volts to 12 volt converter to make sure that I don't drain what is there from 12 volt from before because this takes a little bit more it's just to be on the safe side I'm fairly sure it would work without but the more 12 volt stuff I put on the more likely or the more I would like to have this one and uh, a relay so I can hook it up to the ignition key so it doesn't stay on all the time. It's for 12 volt but I'm fairly sure it will work fine for 48 as well. And here are the uh, prints that I made. There will be files up on Thingiverse if you would like to make something like this yourself. This is for the bracket for mounting the mirror in the center and then these ones uh, are for connecting this one to to the ceiling. But first of all, let's get some power in there. I did previously install a fuse on these batteries, so I'm just gonna try and hook up to this uh, this fuse and put a new wire all the way up front. Okay, so I have the wire up here and um, just stripping it down make connections for the converter there we go and then the converter itself here And uh, I guess these ones then need to be attached to here, and then uh, this one is the 12 volt currently, so I'll swap that one for the new. 12 volt. I have one more of these converters, so just to make sure. Input is the red and black for 48 volts. And uh, make sure that one is connected to the 48 volts. And put on the Fuse. Then turn the key again. You can check here if hold this one. We have 12 volts, and that we do. That's a perfect start. Okay, so first I will take these brackets that was printed um, and all the necessary screws and install the brackets in the UTV. Oh, I forgot to clean up here. Let's see. So hopefully you'll see it on the camera. 
Um, this one just slide up there like that. And then I have some screws like this. And they just go through. There are two holes here. And those should line up with these holes here. At least close. And then placing in And then one more. that it's fairly dirty up there it's nice mm -hmm. you can attach the mirror to that one and then I have two of these we'll just go up here like so and the media player can be or the amplifier I mean can be on these ones so grab one of these Bit tight fit in this one, but it works. There. Try to make them just as straight as you can eyeball it, but it's fine if they're a bit off, they can there. And then let's get the equipment. There is the mirror and it just has this one cable, that's all. And it has adjustable feet, so I just put it on the top so sure the cable isn't squeezed. And then I can push it down and make it into. Like I can have it in a couple of these different positions, it can be adjusted a little bit, but when it's on it's fairly good on there. So I'll just bring this one over and I've connected this one over here. I have the cable going down to the front. 
And then we also need the amplifier up here. I added up a couple of speakers up here. And some wire for those. That's also very temporary. It's just to uh, get things started, I guess. Try them out. And then I can take this one first. I'll just grab them over there. Then I need a signal cable, so signal cable is connected in the front into the plugs from the unit, and then just loosen up the window a little bit. I can thread it through. Just bring it up. side that and feed it through here and then into the input and then it's just to screw this one in like there somewhere there. and I can tighten them with the screwdriver they don't need to be so tight that they break the plastic I just hold the nut with my fingers and when I can't hold it anymore then it's fine. There I got this memory card. I'll plug that one in. And I turn it on. And there's our song. It started to play, so I just turn this one on. And then, and then we have sound. Not the best kind of music for <laughs> this setup with these bad speakers, but uh, it's the only test sound I could find that I know that I made, so I don't have to have any problems with the rights. <laughs> so it has bass and treble. Oh, it's really, really bad. It has direct. But it works, and with some new speakers, hopefully it will be great. And, uh, yeah. So, that was it. That was the installation of the home printed um, mounts, I guess, for uh, both the mirror and the amplifier. Hope you like it.